Okay, so I'm going to go through. This is the wigs that I don't want. Um, that ottoman over there is filled to the brim with my current looks, which need those two up there. I started working on yesterday, brushing them out. What is this? I'm telling you, it's just overwhelming. Um, this stuff's brand new. What is that? It's not my color anymore. Um, I'm going to see if I can salvage some of these and put them up on the Poshmark or the eBay. Um, why not? Because I have like, <laughs> this is no joke. This is the ones that I'm getting rid of. Some of these, I have to look through. Some of them are hair. Ay, 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 my life. I've just blown money on so much bullshit. I can't. Well, a lot of stuff gets sent to me too, but I can't. This is, oh, this is good hair. I'm going to keep that in case I decide to go brown again. Oh, yeah, look at that. Hey, wig. Hey, wig. Oh, Lord. I don't even know where half these things came from. I swear to God. This is my brush. This might be cute for my undercover move and name change. Think of a new alter ego. Detectives Start speaking very soft-spoken. Yes, dear. Sure, hon. Okay. No problem. Very nice. As you wish. Psycho. Don't even ask. I don't. I don't know where this one came from. This is giving me '80s mom, Karen. But she tells the police that so stupid. Why was this one in that bag? This is brand new. The lace hasn't even been cut. I mean, it's synthetic, but this is good for like whatever. Like you go somewhere where there's going to be a hookah and you know it's going to stink. Like, you know, because your hair stinks. It's, it takes in that smell. But this isn't bad. I went and got the brush. This is workable. I, I'm going to keep this one. Look at the little hairline there. This beauty, it's it's not it, but it looks brand new too with bangs. This is like a 30 some inch. I'm going to work with this one too. I'm going to keep this one. I'm not doing the extensions this summer. Like, come on, it's going to be too hot. And I like to go underwater when I swim. Let's see what else we can find in here. Yeah, this is, this is uh, a lot going on over here. How do you get the knots out of the wigs? I know not to use the oil. Can you put leave-in conditioner? These are synthetic. My good human ones are over there. But I'm going to save some of these. Why not? I might want to switch up a look or be in a mood. Like, yeah, but I'm not, I don't think I'm going to keep some of these funky color ones. I love this. I look like a fairy goddess in the forest. Where's my wings? Gorgeous. I brushed it out. This was the first one I tried on. But I like this hairline. It looks invisible. Let me find out I'm a true wig master at heart. So, um, my favorite hair company in Tampa sent me the three bundles of the Deep Wave. Um, someone is going to make me a wig out of that for the summer. That's going to be glamorous. But this is just a whole mood. This is giving 70s. This is giving just wild and free baby never free <laughs> okay these are the good ones all separated in different bags um it never ends it's it's not ending so i'm going to go through these tonight and get my wig collection right for the summer and yeah. this one would have been great except for this Ooh, i hate that anytime somebody has that i just stare at them whole time I stare at that this right here there's no help in this unless you pull your own hair out and blend it then it comes like a partial wig but my hair is not this color right now but this is nice it's brand new I don't know where I, I swear I don't know where half these wigs came from this is nice but this this kills me this what is that it's doable too brand new Seems brand new. The ends look good. This is giving me 80s high school heavy metal. Um, 
Bon Jovi concert, rock, like, this is how I wanted my hair to be when I was in high school, like, but my hair, I was, I was punk rock in high school, like, I had, like, yeah, I have to show you guys the high school pictures one day, but yeah, this is cute, this is workable, it needs to be done by a professional, but, like, you know, it's doable, I'll put the thing to the side. The mannequin head. That's summer. Oh. And we're Listen, I, I love Dolly Parton. Like yeah. I watch all Dolly Parton stuff. She's never caught off point. So again, Every day she gets up and gets ready. She puts on her wig. Dolly can do it. I can do it. I don't know what this is. This is some like superhero. Anyway, instead of putting them on the Poshmark, I wonder if I can donate them to the Cancer Society for women that need wigs. But they need to fix them. I'm not gonna fix them and all that. I'm sure they have somebody that does that, right? They're not gonna give somebody a raggedy. I'm not gonna give them this, of course. Come on, it's insulting. But um, the nicer ones, they can fix them up. I think that would go to a good cause. Anybody know about this? Let me know. This is nice. This was in the get rid of bag. This is giving me fair or faucet natural highlight. I could throw this on and just go outside because it's covering, cause, you know, it's a pain to do that lace thing and the line. I hate when I see that net with the makeup on it and I've done it. Like, I'm not talking about it, but I hate when I see it on me and it looks crazy on some other people too because it should sometimes real crusty. But this, this is giving. Definitely keeping this one. This is, maybe could be something like, I, I don't know, like, I don't know, like these are the ones I already went through a long time ago and put in a bag. I just found the bag that I want to get rid of. Those over there are better than these. This, this, this maybe with a hat, maybe for Halloween, it's giving Jane Mansfield or something like that. I'm getting serious now. I got the, the brushes, the mirror, I got the scissors. Now, here's the problem. Some of these are okay, but look at the ends. They look raggedy. So, um, on YouTube, I'm going to watch some How to Revitalize. Last time I showed you guys how to take a wig that was kind of mangled looking like this and make it look like that baby back there. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys a different restoration technique to make it look like that baby back there. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys a different restoration technique so you can take your kind of old beat up wigs. Uh, which this one's honestly not in as bad a shape as that one there was. That one had been through the ringer. But to learn but something this one is still really stiff learning, on this underneath section in the nape. So we definitely want to take care of that. So I'm going to learn how to do this. Any guys, any, anybody who follows me that knows about wig stuff, please message me. Give me some tips, pointers. I even look over my bald-headed bitch. Bald-headed bitch. <laughs> I'm concocting a system. I'm putting labels, sticker labels on every bag. So now when I'm flustered and trying to, you know, look for a wig, I'll know. Long, wavy, fairy, middle part, the clip-ins. I forgot I had clip-ins. Brand new. Oh, this is, this is definitely a high fashion, hot couture look. Oh, we're going to have to put one of your gowns on with this one, Diva. We're going to have to stick this to the, her head. Oh, you look like a model. Oh.